Hey, it's Rick from metagamers.com and I want to show you the Canon XA10 today. This is a real fast unboxing video because I don't like unboxing videos, but I'm excited about this camera. So I wanted to show you what you get in the box. You're going to get this big giant manual here that you see. You can also download this, which is what I've done. I've put it on my iPad. So I'll read it on there. You get some software. I think the manual's on one of these discs. Most of this stuff is for Windows. There's warranty card information, things like that in there. You're also gonna receive an AC adapter that's in this bag here and the cord to attach to it. There's a couple of video cables that are included with this thing in the box. You can see there and there. And there's of course your USB cable to connect it to your computer. You're also gonna get a remote for the camera that you see right here. And you're going to get a pretty useless stylus. I mean, this thing is super small. I know you can use this clip and you can probably clip it to this little piece right here so you don't lose it. But I'm actually using uh, one of my other styluses that's an actual full size. I find it a lot easier to use. Not to mention that this tip here, let me get it in focus, is kind of hard. And uh, I like the squishy tips a little bit better. I feel safer using it on a touch screen because remember this camera does use a touch screen. This is the battery and it's a pretty small one that comes with the uh, camera itself. But thankfully, because I've got a Vixia HF10, it uses the same batteries and I've got extended life batteries. Keep in mind, if you're gonna charge this thing, it doesn't come with an external charger. So you charge it within the camera itself. Before I show you the camera, let me tell you, it also includes this handle that you see right here. I've already attached it. It attaches via this screw and this screw, and then of course right here in the hot shoe. And the handle gives you XLR inputs. It also has this separate microphone, uh, I don't know if I wanna call it a clip, but a microphone holder where you can put a boom mic in there, uh, or I'm sorry, a shotgun mic or a handheld mic, and it's got this clip here for cable management. You pop it into one of the XLR inputs, and around on this other side here, you do have XLR controls, so that's pretty cool, and I like that. You also have some controls up on the top here, start, stop, your zoom, and that's a cold shoe, so you could plug something in like a light. It's not gonna power it, but it gives you that capability as well. I've already installed the lens hood that you see right here, and then also we've got a lens cap that's included. It's got a manual focus ring. Uh, it's got all kinds of stuff on this camera. Again, it's the XA10. You can see my extended life battery that I've got on there. It's got a viewfinder. This viewfinder just simply pulls out. It doesn't do any kind of angling, but that's okay. You've got some controls right here. Uh, some controls here and here. I'm still learning this camera, so bear with me. Uh, on the inside, you've got dual SD card slots, and this camera does have 64 gigabytes of onboard storage, but you can record to the SD cards as well, or you can set it up in relay mode to where it records to one and backs up, records to the other at the same time as a backup, or it records, let's say, on the hard drive, and when you run out of space, it automatically pops to one of the SD cards. So all kinds of stuff. I'm not gonna turn the camera on here. I'll do that in a future video as I learn the camera and show you the ins and outs of it, but I'm pretty excited. Again, that's the Canon XA10. It's what you get in the box. A lot more features I didn't cover in this video, but look forward to it in a future video. If you guys have questions or comments, please feel free to let me know. Otherwise, take care, everybody, and have fun.